Hello everybody, Unicorns are back with another video for you and today we start with our brand new heading Pumping Up with Unicorns. Our first video is written by one of the best mid laners in the CIS region, Leo Norman Zyakshin, who is among the top of 100 best players of European West server. It should be noted that these champions are not his favorites and Nomans doesn't play them too often, however, they are good for gaining elo in solo queue. So in this video we will tell you about Ari, Diana, Nico, Jace and Pike. You will find the best runes, builds and skill order and gonna get good tips for a quick start for each of them. So let's get started! Ari has two versions of the runes, but Nomans is more up to electrocute, as Glacial Augment is tied up on catching the opponents with the such items as NLP 800 and Twin Shadows, and moreover with the team play, which usually is not the priority of your teammates. Ari is a champion against whom seems impossible to win in the conditions of lost side lane. What does it mean? I'm playing Ari, I see my top laner dominates the lane, I push mid with Q, go straight to the top. I take the enemy's top laner with his tower and plates and repeat this until the opponent's top laner presses Alt 4 to drop the game. You can perform same trick on a bot lane. The skill order is shown on the screen. Talking about summoner spells, better to take Flash and Ignite. Diana is currently the best AP assassin for solo queue. Why? She survives on the lane due to the shield and can be extremely dangerous by getting early kills. We advise you to build her full AP starting with the Spellbinder, Rabadon and Magi if you are ahead. Later on you should get Void Stuff or Morella as well as you can use such protective items as Bunch's Veil and Jonas Hourglass. After level 6 you should try to solo kill the enemy's mid laner but before jumping forward you better poke the opponent with a couple of Qs. Note that it's almost impossible to survive from the correct broadcast of Diana with Ignite. The skill order is shown on the screen. Summoner spells better take Flash and Ignite. Nico is the most diverse champion in the game. She can be played in any position but the mid lane suits her better than any other lane. She is the champion who depends mostly not on the number of items, but on the level in the game, so try not to leave the lane for a long time. Level 13 is Nico's power spike. 3 seconds of AoE root is incredible and only Nico has it. Moreover, you have stun from the ultimate. Know that all skills deals AoE damage. Considering all of that, we get the best control mage in the game. If you prefer proactive plays, better take perfect timing instead of magical footwear. Also dishonorable to mention that you can make your life easier by collecting NLP 800 or Twin Shadows. This will give you a better chance to hit opponent with your spells. The skill order is shown in the screen. What to take from the summoner spells? In professional games it is common to take teleport, but we advise you to take ignite in order to try to get an early kill advantage on the lane. Jace went through the large number of nerfs, but returned due to the updated mana moon, which now is the core of your build. On the lane you should play aggressively, but do not forget about warding totems, because early death can throw you out of the game. The main power spikes are on level 7, 9 and 11. At this time your poke became so strong that couple of procasts with combination of Q plus E will give you a chance to destroy an enemy without any help. Already at level 4 you have 6 skills, use them wisely and if you cannot kill enemies mid laner, move to the side lanes and make a siege with your teammates. The skill order is shown on the screen. Summoner spells always take flash and ignite. The last but not the least, Nomans would like to advise you to play Pike. He has rather complicated laning phase, but with the purchase of time at and mobility boots, the game becomes as enjoyable as possible. The entire gameplay looks like that. 
push the mid lane and run to the top or bot using your W. It is always better to roam to the bot lane, because there are two sweet kills waiting for you. However, it's already been said, there will be difficulties during the laning phase in the early game, so do not forget to use your passive. If you suffer and you lost too much HP in a trade, you can restore it behind the tower or in the bushes, the best places where opponent cannot see you. Just take care of the minions and try not to lose them while roaming. The most important playing pike is to hit enemy with your ultimate. The easiest way to get the kill is to slow down the target and always take your time and wait for the right moment. The skill order is shown on the screen. Summoner spells, take flash and ignite. That's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please drop down the like and subscribe button and stay tuned. Unicorns are back to surprise you. The video was produced by VT Productions specially for Unicorns of Love.